What's up guys, Hong Nguyen, OG Fitness. Welcome to the channel. Subscribe if you haven't subscribed already. In this video guys, we're gonna talk about the number one skill for you to master first in judo. Break fall. You gotta learn how to fall, guys. That's the most important thing. If you don't know how to fall, or if you're afraid of falling, guess what? You're never gonna be really good at judo because, well, you're gonna probably get injured, that's one. Two, well, you're gonna always uh, be afraid to throw, to attack, you know, to uh, to try things, and, and you'll always be resisting. Like, because in judo, if you wanna get good at judo, you gotta be able to, you know, throw your attacks, you gotta be, Relax, man. You gotta be relaxed. And, and falling is, is, is a scary thing, especially if you're not used to it. We're not kids, right? N none of us, when we start older in life, we're used to like just falling. And also we're heavier, so like it does hurt when you fall wrong, when you fall the wrong way. Whereas when you're a kid, I mean, you're, you're, you're this close to the ground. You don't see my hand, but let's say the ground is here and you're a kid, you're like here, so you don't have that far to go. Whereas if you're an adult, you're here all the way down. It doesn't take much. You don't gotta be like 10 foot up in the air uh, to, you know, to, 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 to break your neck, you know, you could just fall from in my position here. Somebody sweeps me. I'm only five foot, uh, seven, five foot eight, some, something like that. So if they sweep me right now and I go whoosh and I fall, clack, I could, I could bust my shoulder, you know, easily. You can break something, dislocate, whatever, all kinds of stuff. And if you learn how to break fall properly, it's going to help you to avoid injury. And because if you resist and you fall the wrong way and the person just, you know, forces it, like no Vaseline, you know, like rips you to the ground kind of thing. And you're like, that's happened to me. Like you're going to get hurt, you know, uh, your knee's going to go or whatnot, or, you know, it's just going to, it's going to be painful. Uh, you know, you might tweak something in your back, all kinds of stuff can happen. When you break fall, when you learn how to fall, like if, if somebody catches you, just accept the fall. But for you to accept the fall, you have to, first of all, not be afraid of falling. And then from there, you actually have to know how to fall. Well, if you're not afraid of falling, it's because you know how to fall. So you accept the fall and then you'll be okay or you'll be much, much better off. You got to practice that a lot at the beginning if you don't already know how to break fall. Well, this video is for guys who don't know how to break fall or who are about to start or, you know, but you got to put a lot of emphasis on that. And that's important. Now, another detail that's really important. You have to, for you to be able to break fall properly, you have to know how to roll. What I mean is you got to be able to front roll, side roll, backwards roll. You know, you have to be very comfortable in those positions. Like you have to understand the basic concept of having your, your chin tucked in, right? Like essentially you, you're looking at your belly button, you know, when you fall and then you got to look in the direction of your fall and so on and so on. Like I'll, I'll make some videos on that. Uh, when, when I get the chance right now, I'm in lockdown, so I can't really do anything, right? Don't have access to, to gym. I'm not gonna start break falling on concrete. I, I could do it, but I'm not going to. <laughs> Just to reiterate, break falling is the number one skill you need to learn if you're gonna start old, like uh, it's super important. Like clubs, you know, they don't spend enough time with this when it's like, you gotta get comfortable at falling, man. You gotta get really comfortable at it. So really comfortable and good at it. It shows, man. I've met black belts who are afraid to fall. Like they know how to break fall, but they're afraid to fall. Yes, they're good at maybe beating up beginners, but when they go into competition and they're fighting other guys of their level, it's, it's the worst judo ever, man. It's like, like they're, they're, they're st both of them are stiff like this and, and they're both afraid to fall and they just, just, you know, they just tapping their legs, you know, kicking, like trying to sweep. And like they don't throw, they don't move and stuff like that. It's because these guys are so stiff, so afraid to fall. So you want to get over that fear of falling. If you're not afraid to fall, it's like being able to roll with a punch. So what I mean by that is in boxing, if you stand there and you just eat it, like that's it, you're out. But if you roll with it, you're okay. So accepting the fall, that's how, that's how it is. Like if you resist, you can get hurt. That's it. All right, guys. Love you very much. Peace. So thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and click on the notification bell. Also, there's a link down below. If you guys click on it, it's gonna bring you to a page where you could follow me on all my social media platforms. And you can also apply for, uh, for coaching so that you guys can work directly with me. Also, one last thing guys, if you have any questions, right, send me an email. That's the best way to reach me. I read them and I'll, I'll answer your, your questions, man. All right, peace.